don't know. I do know that. But what I was saying was that I know that you're not a politician. So I know that you're going there for a reason. You do have a dream and you're pursuing that dream. But the politicians you're working with, like you said, for you to get in there, you need the votes of the politicians and not the ordinary people. So I'm saying, how are they receiving your message? Uh, some of them actually have been very, very positive. Uh, some of them have told me that, you know, because I've, I've been doing this on the phone or on the email. And, you know, not everybody who respond. Actually, only a very few of them who respond. Um, and, you know, many of them say, oh, we know you. We know you even for the work that you do with the organization. Uh, we will consider you, you know, but they, they are actually ob obliged first to vote for the party. So even if they vote for me, they will give me the, maybe the second preference, you know, which will be their highest preference. Um, so just to say that, you know, I've actually not come across any of them who have been negative or who have been very reluctant or abusive. I've not received that, I won't say. Uh, the ones that have come back to me, whether they are TDs, I have TDs actually who have come back to me, I have senators who have come back to me, and some councillors, they've been very supportive. Actually, I just received a message yesterday of one who said that although I'm, I have to give my first vote to my party, I understand the need to have diversity, you know, and that inclusion. And for that, I will give you my vote, you know. So you have very good ones who are very much uh, interested in um, these voices coming coming in, you know, voices from, you know, f that are never heard or from other diversities, which is actually very good to see. So, yeah, I must say that, you know, majority of them are very positive. Um, there are others maybe who are reluctant to respond, uh, but you go with the, even if you get one person to support you, that is enough in itself. You just need people to encourage you and to motivate you. And which area are you looking for votes? Because people know that, for example, TDs, they have different constituencies mm -hmm. that, you know, vote them in. Tell us about the channel. How does it work? Okay, the the the, the Shannon, uh, has sixty seats. So those sixty seats actually, the Tishok, which is the who is the prime minister for for our country, like we call it that way, he has the opportunity to appoint eleven people. So he can appoint whoever he wants. Most of the time, people are appointed from parties, you know, from political parties or political backgrounds. So those eleven, then we have people being selected, six of them from the university. Uh, universities that we have. So the university people are selected or they are voted by student. Whether if you went to Maynooth, if you went to Galway University and UCD. If you've registered to vote again, you, ca you might have gone to those universities, you got a, a degree or diploma or certificate, but you need to, to actually register so that you can become eligible to vote. So those students who are eligible to vote, they can vote for the, 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 those who are the six positions going for the university. Then we have the 43 ones. These 43 are voted by the politicians. And actually these 43, myself, uh, I'm in one of the panels. So they go with the panels. So we have uh, the cultural and education, for example, panel, uh, which has uh, five seats. We have agriculture. A panel which has 11 seats. We also have labor which has 11 seats. We have industrial which has a uh, nine seat and then you have my panel which is called the administrative panel. The administrative panel actually include organizations, you know, people representative of organizations. So there are seven uh, positions there. But these 43 uh, seats are voted by politicians. Who are the councillors? We have around 944 councillors in this country. We have 160 TDs or ministers um, in this country. And then we have um, the senators, who are 60 senators. So these are the people who are voting, and they are the people who will be voting for me. So as you can imagine, most of these people have parties, or they are part of parties. Uh, we have um, independent as well, uh, who are voting. And, and that's how the votings are done. So they were sent the envelopes. The voting started actually on the 16th of March, which was Monday, for my panel. But for the university, the voting started uh, a week ago now, you know. So, and then everything should be done. Everything should be finished by the 10th of April. We should know uh, who is going forward for the Senate.